The Blair Witch Project's ending has haunted horror fans for years, but what really happened in the movie's chilling final scene? The first movie in the Blair Witch Project series was a low-budget independent horror film from co-directors Daniel Murek and Eduardo Sanchez and told the story of three student filmmakers who wander into Burgettsville Woods to investigate the legend of the Blair Witch. In the forest around where the village of Blair once stood, they encountered the Blair Witch, although the movie's Blair Witch monster is never really shown in full. After the ending, the trio is never seen again, but a year following their disappearance, the footage they shot is recovered. It's this real footage that the movie is made from. There are a number of theories about the real killer in the Blair Witch Project, but the most commonly accepted is that the Blair Witch lured Heather and Mike to the house and killed them there. Other theories state that Burkittsville locals are the ones responsible for the killings, possibly leaving the Blair Witch stick figures as effigies or totems of worship, or that the witch possessed Josh and he's the unseen attacker. 